The Great War, otherwise known as World War I, was and is one of the most significant events in human history. Many nations across the world participated in it, including Canada. But how significant was Canada in the war? To answer this question, let's use an artifact and a soldier to represent the significance of World War I and Canada's involvement in it. The artifact that I chose was the Canadian Service Dress Jacket, and a proud Canadian soldier that wore it was a man named Robert Clarence Borden. Robert Borden was a student, and at age 20 volunteered to join Canada in the First World War. He marched proudly into battle in multiple nations and in different battalions. He even got promoted to sergeant, but was sadly killed in action around one year later. You may wonder, how could a man with such a small involvement be significant in the First World War and prove that this major conflict was significant? The answer may not lie in him alone, but the collective of soldiers he represented. He was one of the many who gave up their lives to help shape what Canada is today. If it wasn't for these thousands of soldiers who died, could we still call ourselves an independent nation? Understanding this will help us to understand what made the Canadian Service Jacket significant. The Canadian Service Jacket was the very wear that these Canadian infantry marched into battle with, and its significance in the war can be proven easily as it is not only symbolic, but widespread and notable as well. The jacket symbolism can be shown as this item represented the unity of each and every soldier in the war. Not only did it help you know who your allies were, but know that the other men wearing this would die, fight and bleed together with you, while representing their nations. It wouldn't even be a long shot to say that this was the pride of many soldiers. Some soldiers were even willing to wear their service jacket to their wedding, and some higher ups used their own money to get better tailored versions of these jackets. It was obviously widespread as every soldier or civilian who was involved with Canada in the war would recognize it, and this jacket was notable because of its extremely important practical use. Every soldier who wore this jacket would not only remember this as a durable piece of cloth, but an important item that kept them alive through hard-fought battles. Camouflage, staying warm, storage, and breathability are all examples of many features that saved many Canadian soldiers. So after understanding the jacket and Mr. Borden's significance, how can we use them to prove the significance of the First World War? Well, from just looking at the significance of the involvement of Robert Borden, we can clearly see how widespread and notable the First World War was, and is, as it was a multinational conflict that spanned many years. The service jacket proves the war symbolism as this is not an ordinary coat that kids wore to fight, but a piece of clothing that a united front of soldiers wore to represent their country. In the end, the First World War's significance can be proven in many different ways and with many different artifacts, but even then, the service jacket that men like Robert wore into war was and is a significant artifact. Now after understanding why the First World War was significant, what's this got to do with you? Well as a Canadian, I can say it affects us in many ways. Not only did Canada participate in it, but it was also the first time that it fought, spoke, and even signed treaties as an independent nation. And it's not just Canada that the First World War helped mark the first step of independence, but it was also Australia's first time signing independently. This is not even mentioning the many nations that would eventually become independent due to conflict and opportunities arising from this war. In fact, not just nations stem from this war, but even our products and actions today are sometimes dictated by the past. For example, the technology in healthcare to military to communication all vastly improved because of this one conflict. The world today may have even been more sexist as the war helped shape the role of women in his society today as many jobs to open up. World War I is undeniably significant today, to me and to you. And unless you've been living under a rock your whole life, then I hope you can agree as well. <laughs>